Hey guys, Ryan Lutz here, and today I want to demonstrate breaking in the new Dragon 4 Edition 2 and how easy it is. So what I've done so far is I've preheated the engine. You can see we're a little over 150. That should be good enough to start with. So I'll take off the head heater here. So anything just closer to 200 is probably better, but anywhere above 150 is a good starting place. So then I got the fuel tank fuel full up. I'm going to pinch the pressure line, snap the lid shut, and you're going to watch the fuel that's priming it. So the fuel's all up to it, got the box on, and we're going to turn it over, and then apply the igniter, that's tight, all right, so that's our first time, that's the first time this engine's been fired, so you can see how easy it is just to turn it right up, I never touched any needles, that's just how it came right out of the box, so we're going to let it warm up a little bit more. If you're where it's really cold, you know, you can have leave the head heater on it, help it to warm up even quicker. Or you can put a towel over it, whatever you need to do. Now I have my radio on as well. I'm just holding a tiny bit of throttle. I can even let it idle. There's the idle that it comes out of the package with. So you can see it'll hold itself and hold the idle good. Now once it warms up, the idle might raise up. And then we can start to adjust the idle down a little bit. There you go, you can see it, it just raised up. That's all on its own. So we'll adjust the idle down just a little bit. But we do want to keep it a little bit high as it's brand new. Just allow it to keep idling and not stall or anything. You see the temperature is rising up to 180 now. Just give it little throttle inputs. Just there it's it's already got a decent tune to where it's, it's running rich but it's got a big idle that'll keep it running and it's just that easy guys so now you just do three to four tanks of easy running on the track and you're ready to go race so you drop the idle a little bit more again you can hear a drop right there and it's just that simple so i thank you guys for watching i uh hope i showed just how easy this is and get it on the track and start racing so have fun, guys. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.